Ugh. I, my friends, am done. Live show's over. I wanted to give a quick update on what I did. Real short, short and sweet. Um, first of all, uh, yeah. Second of all, I uh, mounted the EPG. This is a piece of polycarbonate. You can see it's clear. I went ahead and did that. I know I could mount it on some wood. I decided that if this thing works, you know the skeptics out there, I'd have to go back and remount it. So I just went ahead and got it. I think it was like 36 bucks or something. It was reasonable. Um, Chris actually got it for me. So thank you, Chris. Um, I offered, but he went ahead and did it anyway. So yeah, got that. Got it mounted. Um, the second thing I did today was I'm working on the Rustic 7.0 and the reason for that is because I need it to run the gas gun. So this is actually going to be my controlling device for that. Now um, again it's not the exact same as what Stanley was doing because he was actually doing resonant cavity and I am doing um, a little bit different but same principles should work the same just not exactly. We'll see. Um, so, really quickly, I'll show you how I mounted these. Believe it or not, Stan has his zip tied, so I thought, you know what? I'll zip tie mine. <laughs> so I did. Um, I'm actually pressure testing this right now. We are at a little under 20 PSI and holding steady. So we'll, we'll leave it there for a while and see what happens. Still got it connected to the uh, pulse fire. And uh, I did get it assembled. Uh, as far as uh, attached here, that was a bit of a pain, but I got it because it was so close. But yet, then when you tighten it, it goes back together. So you have to pry it apart just a fraction to get it in. But um, yeah, so far so good. It looks fine on here. Um, yep. I'm going to make a couple of feet, just like standard little aluminum feet. I got some aluminum. I'll just go ahead and make some. Um, Right here you can see how I've attached it. There is a little piece of rubber here. And Stan actually had his taped. So I went ahead and put a piece of rubber in there and then taped it. And just kind of sitting on there. Um, I really don't know if it's the same height. It's probably a little higher than what he had, but his were probably about that tall. Doesn't really matter. Um, so yeah, there you go. EPG, flying high on its new baseboard. And that's it. Short and sweet. I want to say thank you. And I want to say for all of you who were at the live show, awesome. If not, um, the website now, my website, rwgresearch.com, is actually going to have uh, justin.tv embedded within it. So you can actually go there and watch it. It's pretty cool. You can do chat. I don't know if you have to be logged in. You might not have to be. I'm not sure. Um, but you can go right on there and you can watch it. So that's pretty neat. Um, thank you for um, Matt for doing that one. He was playing around and he's got my, my website all screwed up. It's actually, theoretically, it's his website, so he can screw it up, but I did a lot of work on it. <laughs> Matt, fix it. He's doing all right, though. Um, peace and love to you all. I'm out. I'm going to bed. So, again, peace. Have fun. God bless you all. Take care.